My name is Peter Adamczyk. I'm a co-author uh, on the study out of the University of Michigan, a uh, study on why the arms swing when you walk, because it doesn't seem fundamental and we wanted to know um, what it's worth to you, why you do it. Well, it turns out that it's hard to stop your arms from swinging, since they're here hanging from your body, and your body moves up and down and back and forth as you uh, walk cyclically. Uh, that just causes your arms to swing. There's a particular amount of calories you burn to do any particular activity. It's considered evolutionarily beneficial to reduce that during any activity you're doing. So, so the usual way of walking, uh, you picture your legs just moving in their cyclic pattern, left, right, left, right, and your arms would move in the opposite pattern, right, left, right, left. This kind of uh, balances the, the rotations of your upper half and lower half and uh, makes it a little easier to walk, and that's where the lower energy comes from. So a lot of this research seems kind of abstract, right? We bring people into a laboratory and have them move in these weird ways. But this one's very relevant. You can walk down your own sidewalk and uh, try to move your arms. Try to reverse them from the way you normally do. See what happens when you carry uh, a suitcase or a, or a bag of groceries in one hand, and uh, just, just watch what your other arm does to make up for it. Try to hold them still and see how that... You might look a little weird, but uh, you can explain the whole story to your name. No problem.